This video is on preparing an annotated bibliography. An annotated bibliography is similar to a reference list. However, annotated bibliographies include a paragraph of description and evaluation of the resource. At the top of the annotated bibliography, the heading is centered. Don't use the title annotated bibliography. Instead, use something relevant to the subject of the entries. For this example, I've used environmental temperature increase. Commonly, annotations are 100 to 200 words in length, and the citation is usually not included in the word count. Let's look at the parts of an entry. Each entry starts with the citation. This example is a book chapter cited in APA 6 style. Your assignment may require a different citation style. For more information on the proper citation of resources, click on the link to visit the library's referencing page. You will then need to use your critical analysis skills to assess the resource. Begin your annotation of the resource with a description, which includes who produced the text, its purpose, and the intended audience. And make sure your description is succinct. This information tells the reader why the resource is important. Also, check your assignment instructions to determine the level of detail required. Next, provide a summary of the key points and key findings expressed by the author. You will then need to provide a comment on the resources relevant to the topic or field of study. Finally, Put all the entries together to create an annotated bibliography. Each entry should appear in alphabetical order by surname of the lead author. Thank you for watching this video. For further information, please contact the library.